Hello, y'all. Welcome back to Powerful Expansion 777. It's Miss Vanessa. We're about to do our collective message for this week. I'm by the water. I'm still on the road. So um, I'm uploading these videos at a later time. They're collective messages for a group of people, all right? And they're also timeless, so no matter when you land on them, if the message is for you, it's for you, that's fine, all right? Make sure um, that you're not trying to make it fit if it don't fit, all right? 222 is the angel number that I'm seeing right now. All right, I see all these little nautical uh, nautical boats out here today, y'all. They moving fast with some little boats. Hmm. We got the vultures over here, I see. I don't know if y'all can see them, but it's about 10 of them um, sitting on this line. All right, beautiful birds. So we got to get into this message, all right? I may get distracted while we're doing some of these messages because just because these birds, I think they're getting used to me in this area because I be feeding them and talking to them and stuff. So they, they be landing on my car. <laughs> All right, we're gonna get into this message though and see what's today's message for somebody. What do y'all need to hear? What do my collective need to hear? Somebody in general need to hear spirit. All right, so also before I get into the message, I wanna say thank you to the people who donate to the channel. I appreciate y'all. Y'all are the reason why when I'm out, I randomly be picking up decks. I've become a tarot and oracle deck collector at this point, all right? Um. And that's thanks to y'all. I want to say thank you to you all who choose me as your reader, your spiritual advisor. Um, at this point, who continue to come to me and new people. I appreciate y'all. I love y'all for that. All right, I'm thankful. All right, and then now we're just going to get into this message. But also, hey, if you want a personal reading from me, make sure that you're going below the video and you're reading my description under the videos right down there, y'all. I'm in transition with my nails, so don't make fun of me. But um, <laughs> if you are wanting to get a personal reader, that information is below on how to contact me. The email is powerful777expansions at gmail.com. My name is Vanessa, a.k.a. Miss Venus Vesta. You can address me either or way, Vanessa or Venus Vesta. Um, if you want to uh, go through my reading options, I have my Etsy shop link below as well at Powerful Expansions where you can choose what reading you want on my shop. I have audio readings, video readings, it depends, because everybody likes different things. Some people don't even like to, you know, they don't care to see the cards, they just want the message, and that's fine. I have questions available right now, starting off at $15. And um, yeah, so y'all take advantage of that. Let's get into some things. So this message here, some of y'all may be getting some type of signs, is what I'm hearing about something. Y'all, I'm at an area where, you know, you could park and look at the water, and people are always be staring at my car. <laughs> I like that girl doing my reading in that car. <laughs> All right. Um, so, yeah. So, some of you um, could be getting some signs or something around something that you need to create or something around a choice. You could be at a crossroads with something is what I'm getting here. Um, you could be at a crossroads trying to decide something. I'm getting So, some of y'all could literally be trying to make a decision on some type of work, career, or direction that you want to go in is what I'm getting here. You may have an offer for a new beginning or a chance at a new beginning. And you're trying to weigh out your options or um, you're trying to weigh out your options or, or uh, kind of like decide on which direction you want to go in. For some of you, this could have to do within the field of taking care of bodies or something like that. So this could be massage work, exercise and fitness. It could be um, things that have to do with the health system, but I feel like this is more so like hands on, all right, with the body. Some of you may wanna do something with music or create something. Um, Spirit is telling me to tell y'all that today's message is centered around flowing, letting go, resting, manifesting, letting go. Hmm. Maybe some of you um, want to express yourself, open up about something, or become an artist or do something with music for some of y'all, something with dancing. You could be getting some type of sign. So with, with whoever message this is, whatever you're supposed to be doing, whichever direction you're supposed to be going in, spirit is going to guide you. You're going to get some signs if you haven't already, all right? You may also have some interactions with your family members, your community, all right? They may be giving you their input or their advice if you're asking them for it is what I'm getting here. Hmm. All right, yeah, this is about somebody who's taking care of their body, y'all. Look what two cards just came out while I was shuffling this. I'm shuffling this and these two cards just came out. We got whole self health and we got your physical body, all right? They say respect your physical body. So some of you could be learning that you need to um, maybe pick up some practices of eating better is what I'm getting here. Um, eating more natural is what I'm picking up on. I'm seeing cinnamon herbs here in this picture. I'm seeing 
um, eggplants, cucumbers, bananas, apples, potatoes, carrots. Some of you may need to do some type of detox, some type of cleanse. The card says natural therapies, balance, Ayurveda, Ayurvedic. All right, some of you may need to do some type of, you just need to get back to holistic food is what I'm hearing. And there's also something about, yeah, the card says detox. I didn't realize that. There's something about you needing to raw something out. When I say raw out, I mean like um, draw something out. So look, I'm not a health professional. Y'all not gonna get me in trouble. Y'all not going to get me in trouble. That's what y'all not going to do. All right. Go seek uh, legal help when it comes to your health and things like that. Talk to your physician or your doctor or check in because y'all ain't going to be passing it out, blaming it on me. But both of these cards have to do with your health and also with you detoxing your body and rejuvenate yourself. All right. Relaxing. So doing like a reset is what I'm getting here. Like if you know that you can do that or you know, you know, you got the okay from your doctor, go ahead and do that, y'all. Or your physician is what I'm getting here. All right. <laughs> The reason why I'm saying that is because um, I have some music playing in the background, y'all, so hold on. The reason why I'm saying that, y'all, is because um, I feel like some of y'all could be, like, about to start this or you're wanting to start this or you have, like, some type of opportunity to start this. This don't even got to be about your work. This could just be, like, you wanting to do something concerning your body. Yeah, it could even be like you're trying to decide about something. I'm hearing like it could be that you're trying to decide something. Spirit saying is detox or uh, fast. This is going to help you. But this is really like a whole system detox is what I'm getting here. Like somebody getting back to some. Um, also, hmm. Also, Spirit is saying somebody just needs to get back to taking care of their body in general. Is this somebody just need like this could be your sign. I feel like this could be your sign that you need to respect your body or something like that. They make better decisions when it comes to your body and your health. Okay, so let me see here. I gotta be strong. Somebody may have got done wrong by somebody. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Let me give y'all a little... Uh, I, I'm pretty sure if I was to pull out my other deck, the health card is going to come out. With the song that's playing in the background, y'all, somebody may be dealing with a health issue. This is not going to be for all y'all. It don't, it don't have to be, like, um, detrimental, but somebody who's watching my videos, you could be dealing with some type of health issue or something like that, and this is spirit trying to show you something. Like, this is some type of lesson you're going through about respecting your body, all right? I would definitely recommend you go to... Um, I would definitely recommend you go to a doctor if you're dealing like with any health issues, right? Or you see a physician or holistic health, whatever it is. But Spirit is saying this is somebody's uh this is somebody in particular message. You could be male, a man or a woman. So what happened is somebody was put in a third party situation, is what I'm picking up on here. Just I'm just picking up on this from the song that we listen to too, y'all. Somebody could have got sick from something or something like that. And Spirit is saying this is a lesson around respecting your body and taking care of your health as well. This could be about a, num a number of things is what I'm picking up on. Because you say you want me, girl. Make up your mind. Yeah, somebody could have been in and out of a relationship too. So somebody's having to learn. You may even need to detox from sex with somebody else or um, like just draw back yeah somebody need to get back to the earth there's something there's something around herbs and ayurvedic medicine or something like that that's going to help you heal with whatever your health is going through all right so that's somebody's message in particular all right we got the uh we got a, a number of cards here that just fell out on the ground Somebody need to speak up about something is what I'm getting here. Somebody maybe need to express themselves. There could be something about a pregnancy, a birth, or an adoption coming up here. Or something around children is what I'm picking up on. A couple of cards fell on the ground. So hold on, y'all. Um, yeah, look. So we got our motherly card here. The baby and the mama. I love this card. All right. Somebody could be having a child or something like that or getting pregnant soon or trying to heal their body for a child is what I'm picking up on. You may need to express yourself or open up about something is what I'm getting here. Maybe you need to talk to somebody about something. All right. Um, the direction your life is going in. It's time for you to balance things out is what I'm getting here. There's also something about sound healing or music healing, like binarial beats. I'm a big fan of binarial beats. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. I remember when I first found out about binarial beats and sound healing. Uh, like when I first started getting into it it was at a time where i was like losing weight um my weight goes up and down but it was a time where i was like losing weight i was eating healthy i, I had just became vegan 
at that time I was going vegan and stuff like that and it really helped me with a lot of stuff people don't understand how important sound is all right I'm a I'm a firm believer of that and it can just like program you your neural system your DNA and things like that so because the reason why I'm saying that is because we did get this car here the enjoy music all right so some of you may just need to um, pick up your you may need to just pick up your uh, mood with music too Mm -hmm. Some of you may just need to pick up your mood or something like that is what I'm hearing. Yeah, some of y'all just need to get back to y'all health is what I'm picking up on in this reading, all right? So this is not going to be for everybody like I always tell y'all. I don't lie to y'all, but um, somebody just like rebalancing themselves, getting back to themselves. But you could also be about to birth something. You could be about to have a child or something like that is what I'm picking up on. It's this beautiful bird over here. I'm trying to figure out what it is, y'all. I'm really into animals and birds. Um, so something okay. Somebody also, I'm getting somebody could be. I don't want to say that yet, Spirit. I don't want to say that yet. Okay, basically, somebody needs to be balancing out their health, but somebody needs to be speaking up about something. Somebody could be pregnant or something like that. Somebody need to open up about something. It could be around a pregnancy or a child, too, is what I'm getting here. All right, so y'all, we're gonna get into my other cards and see what this is really about. <laughs> okay so why is the whole self-help here spear who is this for <laughs> somebody may need to spend some money on some holistic health items or some um natural health items is what i'm getting here all right somebody could be stuck on something that's going on with their health is what i'm getting here or, or you could be like fearful of something with your health. If you're a person who never did anything with like natural health or natural healing before, you could be fearful on this or trapped in your mind about something that has to do with your health. If you're watching my channel and you know this is your message, this is concerning someone's health, all right? Somebody has some type of fears or some type of concerns around their health, y'all. This is the card I'm looking at here. Someone may feel stuck in a health issue. Like I said, the song Twisted by Keith Sweat was on earlier. And I, I, you know, anybody who know that song, it's an old song. I think in a video, it was another woman. He found out not another woman he found out his woman was seeing other men or another man or something like that she had him in a third party situation so if there's something going on with your health around that or some type of sexually transmitted um disease or a demon or you know entity or whatever like that because you know those are spiritual as well as physical um somebody needs to be getting back to their health through natural practices holistic health is what i'm getting you may need to change up the way you eat you may need to change up your health routine your workout but um get back to the herbs and the healthy eating is what i'm getting here this is what's going to help you come out of this fear or come out of feeling stuck or trapped in something is what i'm getting here all right yeah, somebody hurt or sad, y'all. I got the three of swords here. Somebody really, really hurt or sad by something that happened. This could be your karma, or you may feel like this is karma or something like that, or I, this was fated to happen. Somebody was in a third-party situation, y'all. Somebody's really like in the shadows or in the dark about something. Somebody could be trying to hide that they're sad about whatever that happened is what I'm getting here, or that they're hurt is what I'm getting here around some type of ending. Somebody feel like, whoo. Somebody feel violated or disrespected is the energy now I'm getting here, and they may need to heal. All right, this detox that I'm picking up on is what's going to help you with this. This may not be the end all be all, but Spirit is saying this is what's going to help you with this. And this is not the end all be, a, be all of your situation, y'all. I don't know who need to hear this, but you may need to get a personal reading with me um, with this particular message. Because I'm getting here that someone is like really sad or in sorrow about something. Like they, they feel backstabbed or... Um, I don't know. I just feel like, but I feel, I feel like whatever this is, this could have been fated to happen because you were supposed to get back on track with your health. I know that's kind of harsh to say, but with the cards and the energy that spirit is picking up on with me that I'm, I'm feeling right now, um, that spirit is kind of like pushing towards me. It's trying to get somebody to realize that this is either something you're going to end up doing for your uh, career field is what I'm hearing after you practice with yourself or like there, you, you may be meant to do something in the field of healing bodies and taking care of bodies and teaching people about respecting their bodies is what I'm getting here. This could have been like a karmic or a lesson that you had to learn around your own body and respecting yourself is what I'm hearing. And somehow you're going to be talking to other people and sharing this experience with other people or sharing with them how to get back to the taking care of themselves and respecting themselves is what I'm getting here. Their bodies, their health. 
you could end up getting a lot of attention from this down in the long run like a lot of uh you know sharing this with the public because in this card that i'm currently holding on my hand i'm going to show y'all the lady has two cameras in front of her she has um cameras pointed in front of her like she will be well known for something or something like that is what i'm getting here y'all you see how and then this person over here they're about a tree and they're sad they're in the darkness so i feel like someone is kind of hurt about whatever's going on it could be um on a retreat or a resort or needing to go to a retreat or resort just to clear their mind is what i'm getting here all right to detox themselves from something Hmm. Now, if this isn't like um like anything like a third party, someone could just be sad about some news they got about their health in general. All right, you could just be finding out that you need to change the way that you're eating and stuff like that. You could even be wanting to have a child because we got focus on pregnancy here. All right, you could be, or in the future, you're going to end up having some type of child, so your health needs to be up to par. Is what I'm picking up on. And that's if you're male or female. It doesn't matter. The 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 uh, the father is just as important with taking care of his body a lot of people don't understand that a man needs to take care of himself and his body as well um that can affect the fertility all right especially when it comes to smoking and drinking too so somebody has some type of marriage coming up all right someone could be um deciding to marry someone or choosing to marry someone coming up soon is what i'm picking up here or courting um someone for marriage all right you're going to end up um birthing something with somebody eventually is what i'm hearing here all right so you need to be balanced so you need to be taking care of something why is focus on children here yeah you may need to heal um the children is what i'm hearing or someone children may need healing Hmm. Make sure you're seeing your pediatrics and things like that for your children or taking your babies to their appointments is what I'm hearing or whatever it is. But there's something around someone could be learning to heal children or learning to take care of children that could be sick or something like that is also what I'm picking up on. Somebody's going to be end up doing some type of soul searching and they may realize that they want to have a child is also what I'm picking up on, y'all. Oh, yeah, the card says Dr. Grant. So someone could be taking a child to a doctor, all right, is what I'm picking up on here. So, like, remember, y'all, these are collective readings. So this is not your message. It could be your message, somebody else's message that you're thinking of. What is those birds? They're so cute. <laughs> um, This could be someone you was thinking of when you landed on this video. This could be something that they're going through, all right? Hopefully, I ain't telling nobody's business, all right? So, um... Now, you could be also, I'm, I'm picking up on, this could be two separate situations. One person could be sick is what I'm hearing, all right? And this person may be like, um, or you could be working in the field of careers, the field or career with these type of people who are sick is what I'm hearing. You could be helping these people. I am picking up on, we could be um, dealing with a Sagittarius Leo or Aries woman who's going to be using their voice, all right, to speak out about something, to speak out about something around children is also what I'm picking up on here. So this could be the same person or this could be separate people is what I'm getting here. Someone's going to be using their intuition and speaking to children or speaking to some women who have children is what I'm getting here. This could be for a woman who has children about overcoming something you may be trying to figure out how to move forward how to balance something out or how to grow from a situation all right or this is what someone could be doing for someone else is what i'm picking up on all right we also got a leo sagittarius aries masculine energy here who could be doing music so this could be so this could be somebody who creates music who's a leo sagittarius aries man is what i'm picking up on all right or interested in some type of music they're very confident about creating music all right this this leo sagittarius aries woman could be trying to show you how to move forward is also what i'm getting here if this is your message all right or there's someone who is going to be speaking something um guiding you through something on how to move forward from a situation when it comes to your health is what i'm getting here Oh, yeah. Somebody also could want to travel with somebody because I just heard that Me Too song by Kevin Gates. We both waking up in Dubai. So it could be like a Leo Sagittarius and Aries. A fire sign man wants to travel with a fire sign woman. Somebody want to be, uh, somebody want to come together with somebody is what I'm getting. So this could also be like why you're to being told to like kind of start working on your health. Especially if you're somebody, if it ain't like the std stuff and it's like something else with your health it may just be time for you to get your health together is what spirit is saying i don't know who messages it's time for you to get your health together because you could be about to balance um yeah it's time for you to balance yourself out you could be working with someone 
in particular, I feel like this could be a woman. All right, you could be working with a woman or you're about to have a child with a woman if it's a man watching my channel. All right, and something's pushing somebody to get their health together is what I'm hearing. I was about to say, get y'all act together. <laughs> Okay, so Spirit, what is this about? Why is this coming up here? Why is this hell? Who dealing with this and whose message is this? Who dealing with this and whose message is this, Spirit? Why am I picking up on these things, all right? Somebody definitely feels trapped about a health situation, all right? So we got sacred pool and mountain. Somebody sees something as an obstacle. I feel like someone may have like a health issue that they see as an obstacle, whatever health issue that you're dealing with, and they may just need some encouragement. Maybe that's why I'm on here. Um, I'm telling you this, there's something about the past. I just heard that song, Ain't No Mountain Too High. Whose song is that? Ain't no valley too, ain't no mountain too high, ain't no valley too low. I don't know who song it is. I forgot who song it is. That's an old song. Um, but there's somebody who thinks that they have some type of obstacles in front of them or they may perceive their health issues as some type of obstacles is what I'm getting here. All right. This could be an obstacle. This could be a challenge, but you're going to get over it because we got sacred pool here or something. First, I'm getting here that you need to make your body sacred or you need to understand that your body is a temple is what I'm getting here. You could have made some type of bad choices concerning your body all right and spirit just have, may have just guided you to this video maybe you needed to hear this pep talk that yes you made some mistakes or some bad decisions with your health in the past but this is something that you're going to learn from all right you're going to learn that your body is sacred you're going to start treating your body as such and you're going to be getting back to your health getting back to healing yourself or just taking care of yourself is what i'm getting here and understanding how sacred the body is is what i'm getting here all right but you are going to have to overcome whatever you're going through with your health whatever fears you have concerning your health or that you feel like something that could be stopping you from achieving something that's concerning your health with these cards that i'm looking at here you are going to end up getting over this is what i'm getting here look look that's why we have the sacred pool and the mountain here all right so you you just got to detox you know they say a sacrifice is only a sacrifice when it's something that you feel like is it, is basically something that's important to you that's what makes it so sacred it's something that you don't want to let go or you feel like you can't let go but you're doing it so that you can get a certain outcome so like i said if you have something some behavior some habits or something that you're doing as detrimental to your health that could be kind of damaging your health no matter what it is all right this is just your heads up that it's time to change something that you're doing and start working on your health um and get into holistic health and i'm not perfect from time from time i sway from my health practices in general all right um especially when it comes to food y'all because i love food all right I'm a foodie. So we got magic stream. Hmm. Hmm. Somebody could be coming up on a fertile time. Somebody coming up on a real fertile time where you about to have a lot of new beginnings or you could be birthing something after you heal or as you heal is what I'm getting here. All right. So I hope this is your wake up call or your reminder. We literally have the magic stream here. There's a rainbow here after the storm. All right. Something's about to flow into somebody's life as they heal or once they heal or something like that. Once they do some type of soul searching, someone could literally about to be have some kids or a lot of kids. It could be a commitment coming towards you. Yeah, it could, somebody could have a commitment coming towards them is what I'm hearing. But, but that card said magic stream. So somebody could be asking for something or praying for something or doing some type of magic. In, or you could have did some magic in the past and something's going to flow. Yep, something's going to flow in. Look, this card got a stream on it too, just like the other card. It's just further away, y'all. So somebody could have been spending a lot of time alone. And somebody coming in to help somebody is what I'm getting here. Like as someone's healing, I'm hearing somebody has somebody that's coming in to help them. This is spiritual. This could be some type of divinely guided help or something like that. Yeah, somebody has some type of divinely guided help coming in from them. After some ending, it could feel magical. All right, maybe because it's unexpected or something like that. The way that it come in, this could feel magical is what I'm getting here. What do we have here, y'all? Hold on. Yeah, somebody's speaking up more. This is Leo Sagittarius Aries woman. Somebody's learning to speak up more and this is causing some type of movement in your life. All right, you could be learning the um, lesson. You could be taking the lessons from your past and encouraging other people or encouraging yourself with it. There's something about you moving forward. Y'all, these birds won't leave me alone. They by my window. <laughs> they by my window. They want me to roll my window down. I'm trying to wait till I'm done with this video.
Okay, so um finding their voice. Somebody could be finding their voice after a storm that they had or after something kind of like dark happened in their life. It could be finding their place in the world or finding their purpose but based on whatever. Remember, so I, I said for some of y'all, this is going to lead you to some type of career path. Some of you are going into the unknown slowly. You don't know that you have a commitment or some type of relation coming up as you're healing. Okay, we got balancing act, y'all. And then on one of these cards earlier, we had got balancing. Let me get this card so I can show y'all. We had got balance yourself. So as you learn to balance yourself is what I'm getting here. You're realizing that you're going to have a victory anyway is what I'm getting here. You're going to move forward anyway. All right, is what I'm getting here. <laughs> Somebody's learning that there, it's like you may have thought you was going in the wrong direction. You may have thought something was an obstacle, perceived something as an obstacle, but I'm hearing like it really just puts you right on your path of where you're supposed to go. So maybe some bad news you got could have made you feel like like it was over for you or it was the end all be all, but it wasn't. It was just to reroute you back onto the path, whatever you're meant to be doing, especially if it has to do with holistic health, healing or something like that. I don't know. It's y'all story, not mine. <laughs> I'm just the messenger. All right. So hold on here. We're going to do one more card for this one. And then I'm going to close this video out, y'all, to our next video. All right, until our next time. But um, what, why is the music here? Somebody could be doing music who is um, a Leo, Sagittarius, or Aries, masculine energy, or someone who's very creative. They could work in the creative field. So they could literally be a rapper, a singer, a dance. I don't, I don't get dance. I get like a rapper, a singer, or someone who's doing something with beats or something. They're producing something. Somebody might have a relationship coming up with an artist or something like that or someone who's in the music industry all right that's not going to be for everybody but this is someone in particular's message i don't know why the ministry just came up here the ministry somebody really divine they may be have they may be able to cause miracles to happen or you could be attracted to somebody from the music industry or something for somebody who does music. We going higher. There's something around a home coming up here. Some of y'all could be doing something with music in a home. Or if you're if that's not the case, there's a man who's watching my channel who does music. All right, they're in the music industry or something. Maybe this this message relates to you or something like that. That's what I'm getting here. Look, y'all, we even got another music card. This lady's playing the violin with this spark here. Somebody's definitely doing something around music that's watching my channel. Or that's here dealing with somebody. All right, somebody could be in a dark situation right now, like in a dungeon or something that feels like a cave. Or they could be dealing with some past issues. Maybe somebody feels like they either hit rock bottom or they're stuck in some type of situation. Spirit is telling me to tell you that you're going to end up getting through this. If this is someone who really just feels like I can't. Yeah, you just, Spirit said you got to get specific about who you are, who you envision of yourself. Like you got to align with the vision that you have for yourself is what I'm picking up here. You got to get serious about something. Okay, somebody has a commitment coming in. I kept saying this. Look. Somebody is spending a lot of time by themselves. They could be cutting off a lot of people in their life, family members, friends, spending a lot of time by themselves. There's something that's going to end up happening. You have a commitment coming in. Somebody's going to reach their hand out to you before um, to assist you with something. It could be, um, you know, your foundation or something like that. Okay, look, y'all. I'm going to tell you what I see on this card. I'm getting the energy of somebody that's been through a lot of stuff, right? Whoever's watching my channel. Like, you've been through a lot of stuff, and you could literally just be like, isolating yourself from people cleaning up the house right now um literally or just like cleaning up your circle of friends your family members like i said dusting people off karmics out of your life and what's gonna happen is somebody somebody who's looking for someone i'm getting it there's a man who's looking for someone he gonna end up seeing you all right and but this was crazy you may feel like you don't have much is what i'm getting here these are the cards i'm looking at y'all let me tell you what i'm getting from these cards all right this is the same card that came out earlier you may feel like you don't have much but this person sees this magical stream coming from you they feel like you are abundant rich magical or there's something about you that is like they see you constantly like creating something or they see you as very fertile you may have some type of fears or something like this but this person sees you as like they they see you from afar or something like that they could be in a higher status than you or something like that or they could be like a higher up or something I don't know why it's coming here, but somebody has some type of commitment coming up is what I'm getting here. The commitment card literally just fell on my lap. 
So some of y'all do have some type of commitment coming up that you're being prepared for and you may just like be in the in the in between learning yourself, balancing yourself out is what I'm getting here. Yeah, you got a win coming up is what I'm hearing. You could have been manifesting someone to come along and support you and there is going to be someone who's going to come along and support you. All right, y'all. Remember, these are collective readings. They're not going to resonate exactly with everybody. If you feel like you want a personal reading from me, my information is always below these videos down there in the description box. Y'all, my um, tip and donation link is down there as well for Cash App or PayPal. I do not get y'all YouTube donations, so please donate through Cash App or PayPal. I appreciate y'all. I love y'all. See y'all on our next video. Bye-bye.